Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of SD Locks SCP Readings. This is Shaggy Dreadlocks. Today we're going to be reading SCP-4948 Behind Ajar Doors Before we begin the audio reading of this file, there is a note for our listeners. During the course of this reading, we are going to display the following image. If you feel dread or anxiety after viewing this image, or if you see any unexpected entities, please consult your on-site psychiatrist. Item Number SCP-4948 Object Class Mimetic Containment Class Neutralized Special Containment Procedures Now Defunct Civilians affected by SCP-4948 are to be brought to Testing Chamber 127 at Adjunct Site 4948. The door to Chamber 127 is to be left slightly ajar for two minutes before verification of remediation and return to populace. Description SCP-4948 is the phenomenon of sudden and irrational paranoia of closing doors. It is unknown how SCP-4948 is developed. It is heavily suspected that proximity to those affected by SCP-4948 is a factor. SCP-4948 begins with a slight, unexplained dread at the sight of doors closing. Eventually, this becomes full terror, and the feeling of need to escape the room if possible. If unable to leave a room with a closing or ajar door, affected personnel will report increased darkness in the room and more jagged and aggressive geometry. After approximately two minutes, the subject will calm and SCP-4948 will cease to affect them. History SCP-4948 was first noted after it had begun to affect citizens of the town of Nightford, Minnesota, a small forest hamlet that was investigated after a disappearance of a local family. It was found that all doors within the home of the family had been removed. No traces of the family in question were found. A local hotel was converted into adjunct site 4948 to treat the populace and foundation personnel that begun exhibiting symptoms of SCP-4948. During treatment, most subjects would hide themselves in the corner of the testing chamber until cessation of SCP-4948's effects. During this period of time, recording instruments picked up barely audible whispers along with whimpering from the subjects. From August 31st, 2018 to September 20th, 2018, over 300 personnel were treated for SCP-4948, with all treatments deemed successful. As such, SCP-4948 has been declared neutralized. Of note, is the final neutralization of SCP-4948 in the case of Dr. Warner. This neutralization lasted five minutes instead of two, and was ended with Dr. Warner approaching the door and getting onto his knees and begging the door to not, quote, take it away from him, end quote. This was followed by a two-hour period of unconsciousness, after which Dr. Warner reported being cured. Personnel at Adjunct Site 4948 have reported that Testing Chamber 127 has smelled of rotting meat. This was found to be due to multiple doors made up of organic materials that have appeared within the chamber. Attempts to remove these doors from the chamber have failed. The chamber has since been filled with concrete. And that is it. Do not forget to like, comment, subscribe, and always check behind closed doors. 
You can click that bell for notification for future posts from myself, as lately it's been a little uh, chaotic and all over the place, and uh, hopefully I'll be able to kind of find a new normal and settle into my new schedule, and uh, I'll have something uh, more regularly available. But until that time, posts are going to be a little sporadic. Anyways, check down in the description where I have a link to this author's page. Um... Uh, no related reading materials for this one. Uh, we don't have any stories written about this yet, to my knowledge. Let me double check. Let's see. Okay, no. Yeah. Perhaps if you found this interesting, you could write something about it and post it to the site and see what happens. Regardless, I hope you enjoyed this entry. Until next time. <laughs>